Begin by lying flat on the floor on your back. Grab the right knee with both hands and pull towards the chest as far in as possible. Now elevate the upper back and flex your neck towards the knee. At this point it is okay if the left knee bends slightly. Hold for 10 seconds and repeat process with other leg. Now grab both knees at the same time and pull towards the chest with the upper back and neck flexed towards the knee. Hold for 10 seconds and release. In a sitting or standing position, standing preferred, and with the head in a neutral position, rotate the head to the right by placing your left fingers on your left cheekbone and apply a small and subtle amount of pressure to the right until you feel mild pulling or tension. Hold for 10 seconds and repeat process to the left in the same manner as before using your right hand. With the head in a neutral position, bend the head sideways to the left by placing the left hand and fingers on the right temple and apply small subtle amount of pressure towards the left side until you feel mild pulling or tension. Hold for 10 seconds and repeat process on the right side but using the right hand. This next exercise may be done with caution and only if recommended by the doctor. Flex your head down by applying small subtle amount of pressure by placing either hand behind the head until you feel mild tension or pulling. Hold for 10 seconds. Stand about 45 degrees to the right of the wall about shoulder width away. Place your hands on the wall and rotate the shoulders to the right until you feel mild tension or pulling. Hold for 10 seconds. Repeat process to the left side in the same manner. Stand straight and elevate the left arm to the side of the head and bend sideways to the right until you feel mild tension or pulling. Hold for 10 seconds. Repeat process on the left. In a sitting or standing position, standing preferred, and the head in a neutral position, retract the chin straight back as far as possible, making sure you do not flex the head down towards the floor. From this position, gently extend the head back by looking up to the ceiling as far up as possible. Rotate the head slightly from one side to the other, then return to neutral position. If you become dizzy or nauseous, stop immediately. Start by lying flat on the floor with your arms out over your head. Slide the hands towards the chest and arch the back as far up as possible by pushing off the elbows. Be very cautious to not elevate the pelvis off the floor where contact to the floor must be maintained at all times. Hold position for three seconds and return down to the starting position for three seconds. A variation of this may be done by placing the hands on the side and pushing up with your hands following the same guidelines. To stretch the right side, Sit on the floor and bend the right knee and place it under the right buttocks with the foot pointing straight back in a flexed position. Place both hands behind the back and gently lean towards the floor until you feel mild tension or pulling. Hold for 7 seconds then gently apply a small amount of additional stretch into the same direction and hold for 7 more seconds. Repeat process on the left. 
To stretch the right hamstring, place your right heel on a surface at a height comparable to the flexibility of your hamstring. With the right knee straight, flex forward until you feel mild tension or pulling and hold for seven seconds. Then gently apply small amount of additional stretch into the same direction and hold for seven more seconds. To stretch the left side, swing the left arm over the right side below the chin in a sitting or standing position. Place the right wrist proximal to the left elbow and apply gentle force backwards until you feel a mild tension or pulling. Hold for seven seconds, then gently apply a small amount of additional stretch into the same direction and hold for seven more seconds. Repeat process on the right. Stand parallel in front of a wall about two feet away. Place your hands on the wall. To stretch the left calf muscle, place your right foot halfway between your left foot and the wall. Note that both feet are parallel and pointing straight to the wall. Keep bending your right knee while keeping the left knee straight until you feel mild tension or pulling. Be sure the left heel does not lift off of the floor at any time during the stretch. Hold for seven seconds, then gently apply small amount of additional stretch into the same direction and hold for seven more seconds. The right calf is stretched by bending the left knee while keeping the right knee straight with the heel flat on the floor. While seated perfectly erect on the floor, place the bottom of the feet together in front with both knees bent slightly. Place both elbows on the thighs closer to the knees while grabbing both ankles. Approximate both feet to the buttocks by pulling with your hands while applying gentle force to the thighs by the elbows straight down to the floor until you feel mild tension or pulling. Hold for seven seconds, then gently apply a small amount of additional stretch into the same direction and hold for seven more seconds. To stretch the right side, place both feet together and hands on the floor. Place the right foot as far back as possible. Lower the pelvis and try to rotate the pelvis forward while arching the back until you feel mild tension or pulling. Hold for seven seconds, then gently apply a small amount of additional stretch into the same direction and hold for seven more seconds. Repeat process on the left. 